This is from NFL.com. The most vulnerable division champs entering the 2024 season. Uh, 1A, they say the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. 1B, the Dallas Cowboys. 3, the Bills. And 4, the Ravens. Browns went to the playoffs using a revolving door at quarterback, at backup quarterback. If Watson can finally look consistently like the quarterback the Browns thought they were trading for him, division will be a dogfight from beginning to end. I think it's going to be a dogfight from beginning to end either way. I, I wouldn't yeah. push the Bengals out of that. And if the if Russell Wilson or Justin Fields figure it out with Arthur Smith, they're going to be a problem. Yeah, that's why the Ravens have to be high on this list, just how the margin of error in the AFC North is so slim. Every team's ultra competitive, and they match up well against each other. It's just – it's going to be like a last man standing. It's it's the blood and guts division of the NFL. And even though the Ravens were up to the challenge last year, they have a ton of moving parts. They, they Their offensive line is being reshuffled. And they do have a an eraser quarterback, even if you get a free release on him. He, he can still make plays. But I think that's the differentiating factor is every defensive line in this division is stacked. You know, So for them to be moving some pieces around on the offensive line, that, that, that should make them a little uneasy about their stature in the division. Yeah, without question. The, the division, so I've been getting people who are kind of emailing me, and, and you know, I said I could understand. I didn't say I agreed. I said I could understand somebody that said the Browns would go 9-8. and eight. I think they'll be better. I think they'll be 10-7, and seven, maybe 11-6. and six. Mm-hmm. With this division, there's no margin for mm-hmm. error. That's, that's why you lose a game where you just don't play like you should. You could end up with nine wins in this division. Well, that's why no matter what, no matter who your outside teams are, when you play in this division, you're going to have one of the harder strengths of schedules because there's there's no layups in your division. You don't get to play some sisters of the poor twice a year. Everyone, it's, it's you know, whoever goes four and two is probably winning the division, if that tells you anything about the status of the AFC North.